Hey guys, Dan here, and today we're doing something really, really special. We've got our very own live show, which we're performing tonight, and this is our dressing room. <laughs> hey, look, it's Traoris. Say hi, buddy. Huh. Hey, be nice. Oh, and look, there's Mr. Pig, too. <laughs> so you can put lipstick on a pig. Dan, stop messing around and get ready. Yeah, it's not like you're good on stage. You need all help you can get. I am. I am good on stage. <laughs> they all laughed when I said I wanted to do a funny show. Well, they're not laughing now. The guys have a lot of confidence in me. Dan, live show. Ha, don't make me laugh. I mean, he won't. <laughs> Dan TDM to the stage. Calling Dan TDM to the stage. Woo, woo, woo. And here we go, the big moment in my very own theater. This is my massive live audience. Hello? 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 Oh, hi, Dan. I mean, Mr. CDM. Where is everyone? Um. Must be a mix up with the dates. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess. Yeah, just a mistake. They said after the last show that. What? That they hated it. What? They hated it? They didn't hate it. <laughs> Oh. Right. I don't understand. It was a great show. It was dry. What? Dry? But what about the bit with the pie charts? There were pies. Mmm. <laughs> Never going to work. You wrote it. Ha! <laughs> 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 Dan, you're a star. You don't need a live show. Let's go home. But I wanted to meet my fans in the real world. The real world? You wouldn't last two minutes in the real world. OK, you might be right, but we are not letting this dream die. We've got a week until the next performance to create an awesome show. A whole week! Uh -oh. <laughs> Why can't I think of any ideas? Ah! Hey, guys, the show? Any ideas? Guys, the show is tomorrow. OK, how about this? A play about two beautiful pugs. You're their wicked, ugly stepmom, and you'll what? them. No. How about a clever pig who went to market and learned how to multiply? Ew. No. I mean math. This is a disaster. We're never going to get this show done in time. Dan, chill out. Oh, chill out! Why did you want to do the show in the first place? I don't know. To meet my fans? Yes. Stupid. Ah, stupid! Well, don't you think your fans want to meet you too? <laughs> what did you say? I said, don't you think your fans want to meet you too? Then I said... <laughs> You're right. We can ask my fans. That's what I said. What were you like as a kid? How did you start out? Why are you so lame? Ha 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 ha! Guys, we can do this. Got one day left. Let's make a show. Let's get more of that. That'd be amazing. And then after. Why are you doing star jumps? To know.
We did it. Time to get to the theater. Well, I'm gonna run. It's a really long way. No, I like running. I'll meet you guys there. This time we have an audience. God, that is late. That is late. Car? Why should you go on stage? They are happy. They'll wait. We want pain. We want pain. You're on. You're a scientist. Invent something. What are you doing here? <laughs> you have to tell me something. <laughs> uh, now is not a good time, buddy. <laughs> How's it going, guys? <laughs> oh my goodness, there's so many of you. So good to finally meet you guys. How's everyone doing at the top? You doing good? So what I thought would be awesome is to introduce myself a little bit, talk a little bit about what I do, where I come from. Does that sound like something you might want to hear? Yeah. yeah? Well, I think the perfect way to tell this story is through a medium that I am best known for, the medium of video games. We're going to start all the way at the beginning. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, way further back than I had in mind. Must be around when I was born, I guess. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. What? Who are you? I'm the better version of you. The better version of me? How? You are nothing. I'm here to show all your fans what the real Dan TDM is. You're about good times, not games. You have to take games seriously. I am your upgrade. I am good at games. I've been working really hard on this show. It's going to be awesome. Ha 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 ha! I will destroy you. It was weird meeting my evil twin. His hair was ridiculous. But I had to get on with the show, so I decided to beat him his own game. Literally. Luckily, I'm good at games. Very good. Okay, Evil Dan, let's do this. Yes! <laughs> so you won the game but I'm still not letting you do your show. At least, not before we do a dance-off. Neither you nor any of your lame friends can beat me. You'll never win. You're right, but I have a good friend who will. Welcome to the stage, my good friend, E. Let's get this dance off started. Great. How about the caterpillar? How did you feel when Dan beat you? Beat me? I wouldn't say he beat me. Come on, Evil Dan. You're a bad loser and a terrible dancer, but 
you're still my twin. Come on up here and join the gang. Thanks, everyone. But I kind of feel like it was all for nothing. Maybe we're just not cut out for a live show. Dan, uh, Mr. TDM, that was the best thing I have ever seen. What? You were hit. They loved it. Really? Yeah. Maybe we could do that show every night for the rest of the tour. What? No! So the moral is, sometimes friends replicate you. But when a friend's in need, you drop everything to help them out, even if it's a live stage show you've worked really hard to create. And when there's food on the table, you eat it. I'm Mr. Pig, wishing you all a safe and pleasant onward journey. <coughs> Are those croissants? <laughs>